Does this ever happen to you? Yes, I know. It's been a while since my last upload. Unfortunately, I've been experiencing what's called editing burnout. <clears throat> Luckily, I've been resting a bit now, and I'm back stronger than ever. I am, however, looking for a part-time editor. DM me on Discord if you're interested. In this video, we will be playing more Europa Universalis multiplayer, this time as the nation of Castile, a pretty interesting nation and one of the strongest nations in EU4. In single player, Castile is a pretty easy start. You chill until you get the Iberian Wedding, then blob to your heart's desire. In most multiplayer mods, Castile starts with the Iberian Wedding, which may seem OP until you consider that you have so many day one enemies. Both Morocco and Tunis want to murder you. And usually France will be opportunistic and attack you when you are most vulnerable. This usually means that Castile in the early game is fighting for its survival until it forms Spain. The only nation helping you being Portugal. Most of the time. But what happens when Portugal betrays you? Well, your odds of survival go from slim to almost impossible. Castile in vanilla is a great power as well as it is in this mod. However, in vanilla, you have a really bad heir and a bad king. In the mod, you just start with a bad king. To start, I set up my estates normally, and our economy is doing decent at game start, but it's not the best. We'll be heavily reliant on gold in La Mancha. Speaking of money, that brings us to today's sponsor. Are you the type of person that enjoys playing Oahu at speed 5? Then you might enjoy Raid Shadow People! Join our dark society today, and you can be dressed as a Dementor at the next Met Gala. Wait, that's the wrong ad? Oh, this is an ad for Raid Shadow Legends! Raid Shadow Legends is a mobile game with pretty good graphics that you can play today for free. Raid has over 500 plus unique champions and a full-length playable campaign. I enjoyed playing as the Battle Sage who has the ability to remove debuffs on the entire team. Personally, my favorite part is how customizable you can make your heroes with unique builds. Want the best weekly rewards so you can level up fast? Well, join a clan and fight the clan bosses. Choose your champions wisely and pick the best squad to win and be victorious. For returning players, there's lots of new content as well. There's a huge new Doom Tower update that just came out this month. Just look at this tower, it's so doomy and mysterious. And this entire month is just packed with events and tournaments, including one very special event with a brand new future, Super Raids. Let's look at how much fun I'm having here. If you want to get a huge head start in Raid, all you have to do is hit the link in the description or scan my QR code on the screen, and you'll get an epic hero, Chanuru, who is amazing in the Doom Tower. You'll also get 200k silver, 1 XP boost, 1 energy refill, and 1 ancient shard so you can summon an awesome champion as soon as you get in game. Now, back to the video. Okay, starting moves, we're going to get our boats on the straight crossing. We're going to get these bad boys over here. We're going to protect trade. We're going to put it over here. We're going to rival Morocco. And we're going to ally France. And we're going to ally yeah, you guys play Portugal. Boom, that's done. Um, and then we can now do this. Uh, confirm seize lands. Uh, that's easy discounted advisor right there. Do that. Um, and then where's the one that gives papal authority? We need at least... Well, we don't start with a cardinal as as freaking uh, uh, Castile, dude. Then we will do that. There we go. There's a level three discounted advisor. Land force limit. Do that. He's discounted. Excellent. Uh, we're ready getting raided. Nice. Oh my god. All right. So we're getting ready getting our coasted, coasts raided. Um, and I think that's our starting moves. And uh, now we wait. And oh, Portugal rejected our alliance request. What? Huh? I'm gangster, man. I'm gangster. You know what they call me in the streets, man? Sharmuta, bro. Sharmuta. I don't know what that shit mean, but that shit sound crazy, bro. That shit sound hard, bro. All I need. You know what? Um, I'm just gonna put the music on because it's not like this is gonna be YouTube video, anyways. Grand company right here. 
just right off the bat and then make our air general too i don't want to use the prestige i need all the prestige i can get okay four shock general okay four shock general eight we have our spy on hostile trading two more months i think please one more month please one more month please one more month we'll make this the war goal Fuck you dude Killed Morocco, killed the ships here. Move over here. Third of April. Come on! One, two. Tunis is here too. This is literally a 3v1, man. I, I don't know. I stack wiped that shit, but like, uh, I, I actually can't win. Like, this is actually, this is, this is nearly impossible to win my chat. Of course he's just getting used by the Berbers, dude. Of course he's just getting used by the Berbers. But he's too Pepega to know this. This is getting really tense, man. You know, I'm gonna kiss some muck! Hold! 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 I have no ships left. Back wipe. Go up north. That's how much juice I got. That's so little juice. Ooh. Can we take a monopoly? Monopoly on wine? Monopoly on wool. I'm waiting for monkers. I need this tech. Minus four roll. Come on, hold, hold, hold. Hold. Can they hold?
The back and forth was intense, but it was only a matter of time before I ran out of juice and I crumbled. However, that is when England joined on our side, only because he didn't like the player that was on Portugal. This is when I also tried to get Tunis out of the war, but he also would not budge. You don't want free money, dude? I like free money, but like if it loses, if it... Just take the free money, dude. Just take the free money and let me ruin hour longs game. I don't care. Morocco can win this. He can have whatever he wants, but I want to ruin hour longs game. Ethics, we lose the war. This, I'm not getting any land from this. I'm giving it all to Morocco. I mean, trade, I, this is up to trade. Trade. If you think you can win now, then I'll take it. I owe. You were right about one thing, master. The negotiations were short. Just cheering them on, Fairness, man. I'm, I am all them sit there in the trishing. Yeah, click the button, Nick. Click the mouse button. Click it! After winning some battles with the help of England, we controlled the strait and there were no more troops in Portugal. But that's when France declared war. I'm going to just uh, choose break him. Your, your you okay, to maybe now? I'm going to decline that because I don't want to die. Morocco and Tunis simultaneously also started shipping troops using their transports to Portugal. This was looking really rough, so I just told the France player he can have whatever he wanted. And then finally, another one battle against the coalition, and this was all it took in order to get a stab hit on Portugal. Absolute Habibi, the destroyer of virgins. Uh, yeah, see, they're all retreat. A couple stack wipes later, and again, there were no more troops in Portugal. Once we got 55% war score, we sent the stab hit for him to annul treaties with Morocco and Tunis, so we could immediately truce break him. That's exactly what we did. And quite easily, we fully occupied him despite going bankrupt halfway through, and uh, France declared war on us again. But that was fine because our nation at this point was completely destroyed. All I wanted to accomplish before I left was making sure that Portugal's nation was also completely destroyed. Let this be a lesson. Don't backstab me as Portugal day one if I'm on Castile. I'm going to grudge you until I die. France got a free game, but oh well, that was kind of... It's really not my fault that Portugal wanted to backstab me day one. Either it was, go, it was I was going to die to them or I was going to die to France, and I chose... Uh, to die to France instead and um, uh, Yeah, it, that's it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed uh, this entire experience was live on my twitch You can find that in the bio um, And that's it. I'll see you guys tomorrow for another great video See ya See you, chump. Mm -hmm.